A local zoo is having an exciting Easter event for the whole family. Emily Deem is live in Swamico with more. I am. Good morning, I'm to Doug. Hi, everybody. And they're kicking it off with a yummy breakfast. Take a look at these pancakes, the porkies, the fresh fruit. Look at over here, everybody. The Mayan restaurant is hopping this morning. No joke. There's a bunch of people out here. It's packed for the all-you-can-eat breakfast buffet. There's going to be an egg hunt out here. Egg Stravaganzu is here again for another year. Laura Bugman is here with me this morning. Good, Laura. Good morning, Laura. Good morning. Okay, volunteers are in full force out here at the Mayan restaurant. So tell me what they're really doing right now. Sure, we have staff and volunteers that have been here since 6 o'clock this morning. They're making pancakes, they're making porkies, we've cut fresh fruit, um, just getting everything going so we can serve the great breakfast for everyone. We have toppings that can go on your pancakes, all kinds of good stuff. Now, a really uh, interesting part about this is you're having the breakfast at two different places. We're we seeing are. the Mayan restaurant, but tell us about that. Sure, we have here at the Mayan restaurant, we're serving pancakes, porkies, and fruit. Up at our, uh, the reforestation lodge, we are as well. So there's two parking lots that people can go to. We have staff directing um, people to those parking lots so that we can accommodate as many people as want to come out. And it's funny, I've been watching Laura, you know, in between before we went live, and everyone's coming to you. Laura, the register isn't working. Laura, we need help with parking. <laughs> It's going to be a busy day it for is. you. Yeah, but it's great. We love having people out here. It's beautiful weather, so we're anticipating a really good day. It's our second biggest fundraiser of the year, so we appreciate everyone who comes out here. Now, we were talking about the success of it every year and what people love. What have you seen over the years um, from people coming in and experiencing this? We try to add a little something every year. We have the fresh fruit. We have the toppings that go on the pancakes. Those are always hits, definitely. Uh, we have the grand prize eggs. Um, once the Easter egg hunt starts at 9 o'clock, um, people can collect the silver metallic eggs that are out in the zoo and then turn them in for a grand prize, which is a little bit more special than the candy that they can also collect with the regular Easter hunt. Eggs. Now, the breakfast, you know, started at 8 this it morning. Did. It goes until noon. Are you going to have enough food? There's a lot of people coming in here. I hope so. We planned for a big day, so we're, we're planning to be able to serve until noon. Well, so. Laura, thank you so much for being with us. Thank and you. Angie and Doug, I know I saw a lot of people that were bringing in their Easter baskets. You can see that one over there, a Toy Story one. The kids are just adorable that are coming out here today. Look at that little guy coming up front. The eggs are outside. They're scattered. The egg hunt is going to start at 9. We have all the information for prices and stuff like that on our website. Go to fox11online.com. Click on Good Day Wisconsin. I'm going to send it back to you, and I'm going to go eat this so I won't eat it in front of you and make you feel bad, okay? <laughs> I was just telling Doug how bad I wanted a pancake. <laughs> we have been coveting those this morning. Yeah, they look so good. Angel, see if I can grab one and bring one back for you. Sounds good. Flapjacks. <laughs> Thanks, Thanks so. Emily. <laughs>